Okay, now this is gonna be done not until Friday, but I want to tell you all today, right? I don't know why, I just feel like I should, right? These are the, the, the positions, tasks, that have, to, that have uh, people in charge of tasks that we have to do regularly, right? I'm gonna start with the easy part. I'm always the producer. Twist is a big time person. Actually, the producer one is supposed to have a lot of money, get things together, that, that, that kind of thing, but don't worry about this. So, so here we just put, you know, Brother Anthony, right? Now, for our thing, what's this, for, in, in, in TV they have a thing called sh uh, show runners, like that. But that's, that's a new term. When I say it's a new term, it used to, what, what happens is you have an executive producer, right? And an executive producer is the one that sort of, it's like the producer is supposed to get the money. The executive producer is the one that's supposed to get things all together, you know what I mean? Like uh, allocate them, they stay on top of things. Let's just put it that way. So we, we, because of the way we're doing stuff, we don't particularly have a choice. Usually what I do is every, if, if I have a, a group that's coming every day or, or coming consistently, a lot of people, then what I do is they vote on these kind of things, except for the producer. I'm always the producer. So, um, but they, they vote on these things. But what happens is they can have producer, one that has to be there all the time. Usually they talk to the producer and stuff like that. Well, here's one of our numbers coming down. So for here, again, we don't have a choice. I don't particularly want, you know, this guy, he's always around, so we gotta put him in, sorry. So this is Mr. Cody. Everything is running out. Okay, so the, those two things, right? Now again, because the way we did things, we have to, what I'm going to have to do is I have to pick a director, and I have to pick a, um, a head writer. Okay, these other things, we, as we get closer, we can vote on these things as we come things. But I think, well, we have to vote on these things. So, our director, now you met, you met Piwe on Friday. So Piwe is going to be our director. He said, well, she ain't been here. See, the problem is I know Piwe, and she has some theater training and whatever have you. And a director, in this kind of situation, I have to tell you, well, any kind of situation, a director is not all that. I mean, in film, the director is, but like in theater, in audio dramas, things like that, the director is not all that. Usually what happens, the director says stuff, blah, 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 but you on the stage, what you do, you do whatever you want. I mean, the director can do nothing but fire you. So anyway, I'm just trying to say, the director is a big time position, but it ain't really. The director is basically just directing traffic, directing things as they see they walk no, no. And they're like your eyes and ears. They say, well, that don't really look right. Maybe we should do it this way. That was always a negotiation with the directors, what I'm trying to say. This is going to be P-E-W-I. How do you say P-E-W-I? P-E-W-I. P-H-I-W-E. I know it's something like that. P-H-I-W. That's P-E-W-I. Now, Here's the thing. A secret, what happens is you're, you've been here through everything. You know what I mean? So you've seen everything. And plus you're involved, heavily involved in the writing. So you're going to have to be the head writer. Sorry. So, uh, S I, what's, how do you spell your name? S I H O E. Okay, so it seems like you're going to be the head writer. Again, there's a... <laughs> well, actually, in this kind of scheme, the people that have the most power, if you want to put it that way, is the technical director and the... Uh, actually, is the head writer. Well, actually, the technical director in, a, in an audio drama, the technical director is the person. I mean, without the technical director, there ain't no audio drama. They're just very important. got to get all the... the, the, the the technical stuff together, you know, the microphones and whatever. But here's the trick about the head writer. Oh boy. Usually we start with a lot of writers and then it sort of dwindles down. We get like two, we have like three or four writers, right? Out of that, we pick a head writer. But the thing about the head writing in this kind of situation, it's like a negotiation, but, the, but the, what it is, we sort of negotiate right to the very end. But the head writer is just the one that has the final say. 
you don't argue with the head writer after the when a decision is made, right? But up until then, everybody's trying to, I, I get my thing in, get my thing. So the head writer, it's like they sort of gotta be, I don't wanna say tough, but they have to, when they make a decision, they gotta be strong. Because what happens is the head writer, what they're doing is they're seeing, everybody's putting their con contribution in, and they, you have to have sort of, I won't say one vision, but you have to have a, a clear vision. If you have five people, or four people, even, or even two people trying to discuss them, you don't really have a clear vision. You know what I mean? You just, it's just, you know, it's always like, so you gotta have someone that says, no, boom. Again, in, in, in the film, the director, a, re a regular director would do that, but in most other cases, it's always a negotiation, except, well, it's always a negotiation. So what I do in, audio, in live audio drama, I say, look, we can't negotiate all, all, all the way. So somebody's gotta make a decision, and we gotta stick to it whether you like it or not. This is also why we have, I have this thing where if you're writing something and you're really in love with it, you can make a spin-off. Take what you're in love with and write your own script. So that sort of satisfies the people who want to get their stuff in the, the main thing, okay? So, but these other positions, like I said, we're gonna fill them as we get closer. You know, we're gonna, we, we actually, we're gonna need a, need a marketing person. You know, because as this stuff goes on, we should be marketing already. Hey, this thing is happening. Actually, what's happening, Again, uh, maybe I should go back. The executive producer, Mr. Tolle here, he's the one that's actually doing the marketing now, but he needs, we need to put, attach somebody to him to do the marketing so that they'll learn how to do marketing. You know, all the time when he's talking on Facebook, all that stuff, that, that's, that's marketing, okay? So, we're not, again, I just wanted to tell you this now so be, 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 be prepared and start thinking about this stuff, okay? So that's it. Let's do what we have to do today. We're, we're, we're writing today. We'll continue to write and negotiate. See what happens. All right?